Afternoon Monkeys, John from Yash Monkey here. Hope you're doing well. Right, and another one bites the dust. From Liverpool Echo, from a couple of weeks ago. A police officer accused of turning up for work under the influence of alcohol. The ex-officer could be barred from policing if he is found to have breached professional standards. Well, I can safely say he has. A former sergeant faces misconduct proceedings over allegations he was under the influence of alcohol at work. The ex Merseyside police officer, who has also been convicted of drink driving, is accused of breaching false standards to the level of gross misconduct. While he is no longer serving, options open to his disciplinary panel will include barring him from working for the police again. A notice of misconduct hearing on Merseyside Police's website states the former officer will face dip disciplinary proceedings on June the 21st. So it's over a month ago. It says ex-police sergeant 3279 Ward will appear before the hearing for allegedly breaching the standards of professional behaviour, namely honesty and integrity, fitness for work and discreditable conduct to the level of gross misconduct. The officer will face allegations that on, in July 2020 he attended work whilst under the influence of alcohol. He contravened criminal law by drink driving and received a conviction for the same. And, and quickly following up to that, and the following Monday ward whose Merseyside Police colour number was 3279 faced an accelerated Mersey Police Conduct Hearing. He was judged to have breached professional standards, behaviour in regard to suitability for work and discreditable conduct that amounted to gross misconduct. The disciplinary tribunal formally terminated him Wednesday despite the fact that he had resigned in October. The Forces Professional Standards Department's Detective Superintendent Cheryl Rhodes said all our officers and employees must meet the highest possible standards. The public has high expectations of our officers and Merseyside Place is dedicated to ensuring that we live up to them. When we get information about those who are claimed to have violated these standards, <clears throat> we will always conduct a thorough investigation to ensure that the public continues to have faith in the force. That's not working because well, we don't. What you've got to think about here is just how safe has his work been. If he's been uh, showing into work drunk or under the influence etc enough to the fact that he's been prosecuted where he, for drunk driving just how safe is any of his work that he's done and should that not be looked at especially if there are any arrests he made got to think about these things haven't you if he was under the influence a lot of his convictions etc that he made could not even be valid I don't know how these things work. I'm sure you'll let me know down below in the comments because I love reading your comments. Okay, monkeys, I'll catch you soon. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, more importantly, stay safe, won't you? Eh? Catch you soon, monkeys.